Right, day three, Garen Park, the first race, the Irish Handicap National Chase. Four miles, two furlongs, 0 to 6 to 160. Six years a, years a nap. The top weight is Hardy for the National, Joshua Sullen. Two is Woodland Venture, Dave Hoody. Three is Zama Thinker, Graham Clatterback. Four, Arson Sundown, David Robertson. Five, the Bancher Man, Alex Cherry. Six, Grand Torino, Paul Rhodes. Seven, Lawn Mower, Darren Thompson. Eight is LRLA, Padre Gogan. Nine, Irish Tony Craig Beckwith. Ten is Sherwell, Obi Wan. Eleven, Pride of America, Paul Rose. And twelve, Blanche and Eight, Alex Cherry. Twelve horses in the Irish Handicap Chase. First race of uh, day three. Week three, day three, and away they and away they go, and sure will gets away well from the first fence, and is sure will the leader from Grand Arena in second. Then Hardy for the national for Joshua Allen out wide is L A L A as they jump the next, and oh Zama think is gone. One of the fancy horses, Graham Clodebuck, Zama Thinker goes at the second, and Sure Will is the leader for Obi Wan from Grand Torino in second. Out wide is El Arale, and that one's inside Blanche Nage. On the rail is red in the red and black colours, Joshua Sutherland's hardly for the national. Then comes the Bancher Man, they jump the next, and they're all over it safely. Sure Will the leader from Out wide El Arale. Quickly over the next, a bad mistake by the horse that was in second prior to uh, Gran Torino. They jump the next, LRLA, another mistake out wide. So a few mistakes by these runners, but only uh, one has fallen so far. Sure will the leader from the Bancher Man in second. Then comes Hardy for the National for Joshua Sutherland. Uh, Blanche Nage, no one's outside in between horses, Gran Torino. Then comes LRLA, Pride of America behind that. Then Artisan Sundown for David Robertson, Woodland Venture. That's Dave Hoody's horse on the inside of Lawn Mower. And Irish Tony looks on from the rear. White Steve's um, and White Cap for Craig Beckworth. But it's Obi Wan, the American challenger. Sure will the leader from Joshua Sutherland. Hardy for the the national in second, then the Bancher Man as they jump the next, and they all over it relatively well. It's still sure will the leader from the Bancher Man in, uh, in second on that one's inside is Hardy for the national. Joshua Sullen, Blanche Nage is on the outside of those in between horses is Grand Torino. Alero is out wide, then comes on the rail Pride of America. The second Paul Rose horses, Law Mo just behind that with Artisan Sundown on that one's inside. Outside they jump it well enough near the back. Irish Tony jumped it well moved up on the outside of Woodland Venture and in between those two is Oz and Sunder. They can't pass the lot. Oh, and Lord mo has gone. Lord mo has gone. As the last f fence in the straight as they come past the stands for the first time and we have two fallers now. Lorma has gone as they pass the stands for the first time. From uh, second place is Blanche Nage, Hardy for the National back in second, third. Then comes uh, the Bancher Man, Felix Cherry, the two poor road horses together. Grand Torino and Pride of America, LLA is up on the outside of those. The black horse in the yellow colours. Then comes Irish Tony, Artisan Sundown in between horses and the back of the field is Woodland Venture for Dave Rudy in those lily colours and the black cap. So sure will the leader from Blanche Days in second. Then comes Hardy for the National, Joshua Sutherland here, the most wins in the National Hunt season last uh, season. Beyond that, Pride of America and Grand Torino. Then comes the Bancher Man for Alex Cherry. Out wide is LLA for Patrick Hogan. Beyond that, Irish Tony for Craig Beckworth. And that one's inside Artisan Sundown for David Robertson. And at the back is Woodland Venture for Dave Hoody. Ten horses still going in this Irish handicap chase. And as sure will the leader from Blanche Nays in second. Then comes the Hardy for the National, carrying 12 stone. On the outside there is Pride of America. Out, out just behind that is Grand Torino, Artisan Sundown, the yellow cap uh, is just behind that. On the outside is El Arale. Then comes Irish Tony on the outside of the Bancher Man, who's dropped to the back of the field and Woodland Venture is on that one's inside. So sure will takes him along for Obi Wan from Blanche Nays in second. They come to the next. And they all jump it well. Artisan Sundown was slightly slow, but nothing serious. It's sure the leader from Blanche Nays. Then comes Pride of America for Patrick for Paul Rhodes. Uh, Patrick Hogan's also on the outside. L. Um Then Hardy for the National up on the rail. Out wide, Irish Tony moving closer. Artisan Sundown in between horses. Then comes a Grand Torino for Paul Rhodes. Woodland Venture has passed one, and that one is the Bancher Man, who's at the back of the field for Alex Jerry. The Bancher Man back for another season. He's running the Grand National quite a few times already. So sure will the leader 
from Pride of America in second. Then comes Blanche Nage for Alex Cherry. Up on the inside is uh, the red and black colours of Joshua Sullivan's Hardy for the National. Uh, got past that one now. It's Alison Sundown. Also Irish Tony. Uh, Le Le is also past him. And then comes uh, Grant Arena for Paul Rose. Woodland Venture has passed one. And the back of the field is the Bancher Man. The loose horse is still going. Hopefully it doesn't cause any issues near the back of the field. So sure will. Takes him along. From Blanche Nays in second. Irish Tony's out wide. Then Oz and Sundown. And that one's outside of his Pride of America. Then Hardy for the National for Joshua Sutherland. Beyond that is Woodland Venser. Then comes Grand Torino. LLA behind that. Followed by the Banshee Man for Alex Cherry. So Sherwell the leader. From Blanche Nays and Pride of America, Otis and Sundown in between horses. Hardy for the National, going really well for Joshua Sullen. On the outside, that is Irish Tony. Then Woodland Venture. Three to line behind that. LLA has always been wide. Grand Torino in between horses on the rail is the Banshee Man. So they jump the next, and it's Owl in front, but a slow jump by the leader, and Oz and Sundown has moved closer. Also up wide, Pride of America getting closer. Hardly for the National, who's going particularly well just behind that. They jump the last in the straight, which will be the last next time round. It's sure will the leader from Irish Tony out wide, then Pride of America. Oz and Sundown on that one's inside. Woodland Venture has moved closer now for David Hoody. Hardy for the National, for Joshua Sutherland on the outside of Blanche Nage. On the outside of that is Grand Arena. Hello is out wide and the Banshee Man is the back of the field but there's only five lengths first to loss and any one of these horses can still win sure will the leader for Obi-Wan from Artisan Sundown in second out wide is Pride of America or Irish Tony is wider still in between horses Woodland Venture then comes Blanche Nage on the inside of Hardy for the National who's going well right out wide is LLA is tracked a wide past the whole race Grand Arena just beyond that and then comes the Banshee Man so sure will takes him along as they go down the far side of the track from Artisan Sundown in second. Woodland Ventures moved up into third on the rallies of Blanche Nage. Hardy for the National just behind that on the inside of Irish Tony and LA LA. Then the Paul Rhodes horse Pride of America now dropped back to uh, third from last. Uh, near the back of the field now Grand Torino and at the back is the Bancher Man for Alex Cherry. But it really is only about five lengths off this leader and it's still the leader is still sure will for everyone. There's yellow colour. Sure will takes him along from Blanche and Asian second Woodland Venture Dave Hoody was at the back most of the races moved up into second then Artisan Sundown in between those two uh, David Robertson's horse out wide Irish Tony Hardy for the National is travelling well just behind that LLA being pushed along slightly now they jump the next and a good jump by Hardy for the National is uh, really travelling well for Joshua Sutherland that's uh, in front Sherwell from Woodland Venture in second then at Irish Tony and Blanche Nage uh, Hardy for the National in between Artis and Sundown and LLA out wide is Grand Torino, the Bancher Man and Pride of America at the back of the field. Trying to kick from the front now is Sherwell. Sherwell goes five lengths clear of Woodland Venture in second. Hardy for the National is looking honestly dangerous back in third as they jump the next. And Wood Hardy for the National jumps us really well in second for Joshua Sutherland. It's in front Sherwell but here comes Hardy for the National. Still Jackie has a double handful and Hardy for the National and Sherwell in front but Hardy for the National for Joshua Sutherland moves alongside Sherwell traveling really well Blanche Nage behind it in Arts and Sundown LLA Woodland Ventures going backwards Irish Tony out wide Grand Torino trying to move closer but they were really chasing Sutherland yeah because Hardy for the National is starting to kick clear for Joshua Sutherland and all the name says Hardy for the National he might be for the National so Hardy for the National has gone clear from Sherwell in second Woodland Venture trying to run on again back in third then Blanche Blanche Nage for Alex Cherry, Artisan Sundown and LLA behind that. But Wood Hardy for the National jumps the, sixth, the third last well. He's five lengths clear of Woodland Venture and Sherwood is starting to tie and now. Blanche Nage behind that, LLA and Artisan Sundown. But Hardy for the National for Joshua Sundown has come to the front and the top weight making light work of this 12 stone. Hardy for the National, the leader. And he jumps the next well. 
They've got one fence left to jump and hardly for the national and the jockey is hardly moved on him. He's going well in front. He jumps the last well. Hardy for the national. 12 stone. No effect yet. He's ready for the grand national. He must have a huge chance because he's carried top weight so well. Hardy for the national. Going to win this comfortably for Joshua Sutherland. Passes the winning post at least seven or eight lengths. Clear for Martins and Sundown in second. Ale Ale probably got third. And an impressive performance by Joshua Sutherland's Hardy for the national. Carried 12 stone. Made no difference. Wins it well, yeah, Garen Park. Impressive performance by the winner. Hardy for the national. Wins the Irish handicap chase from Artisan Sundown in second for David Robertson. LA LA for Patrick Owens back in third. Woodland Venture, Dave Hooley finished fourth. Blanche Nate for Alex Sherry's fifth. And the long-time leader, Sherwell for Obi-Wan finished back in sixth.